Travis Levy back to receive for Boston College. Liam Jones puts toe to leather. And we're underway. Levy from a six. His blockers in front. To the 26, he's cut down that time after a 20-yard return. Dylan in the backfield, he'll get the carry. Up the middle, big hole, bounces it outside, clears one tackler, now he's going to get to midfield. Stiff arms another one, and finally run out of bounds at the 41-yard line of the Jayhawks. Drew Prox chasing. Big flag on the play, too. Could be an extra 15 yards on this one. Eagles not wasting any time. Again to Dylan, huge hole. Stiff arm to the 10, he'll be first and goal for the Eagles. The field means nothing if you don't get seven points on the board. To the corner, trying to find White. Look for a flag He's there. Pushed, and there comes the flag. First and goal now from the two. Hand off to Dylan, over the top. over the pile. Watch this right here. He takes off for about the three, four yard line. Let's see if his elbow's down before the ball crosses. It looks like it might have been short. Let's see. When the elbow hits there, it looks uh, like the ball looks, is yep. too hard to I think it's too close to call. Every... Williams again in the backfield. Frank and Stanley. This time the fake to him goes over the top. Had a receiver and it's intercepted. Mm -hmm. Intercepted by Alex Track. Continues to stay on his feet. He's out of bounds inside the 30-yard line. BC back in business. First real throw down the field of the game. He gets plenty of time and just, I mean, he just doesn't get the ball in, in there. And lofts it, doesn't plant his front foot very well. On the gun, CJ Lewis. Could not quite connect on the outright Hassan defense, one of the best names in all of college football. This is a place that Boston College really struggled last year. Kick is up. And it's good. We got a flag on the play. Yeah, kind of like, yeah, we know it's your bad. <laughs> it's not the hand off that time, and Williams has room. And that's what he can do for you. He's a little guy. Coming in at 5'10", 170 pounds. Nine yards rushing in the last of Carolina last week. You know, Herbert now spelling him. He's the bigger back. Couldn't spin away from the defense that time. As he was dropped and Marcus Valdez maybe got back to the line of scrimmage. Looks like he lost the yard. This is third down now for Kansas. Going to extend this drive. And they'll go quickly. Herbert takes the pitch. And he ain't going to get anywhere close to the sticks. Maybe picks up, two, maybe picks up three yards on the carry. Guy watch list for Kansas. I like to put his toe into it. And he gets off a good one. Low line drive. This one's going to go right inside the five and may, might be able to be killed right there. But it looks like it's going to be. What a job by this Kansas punt team. Elmore Hempstead down on coverage. This team, Kyle Thompson, kills it inside the five. That's where Boston College will take over. Up 10. Kansas trying to sub in. And they do, just in time, but Dillon finds enough of a crease to pick up the first down and move the chains. Bailey, just a big old boy, sophomore from Ridley, Maryland. Puts his head in there, still powering. Gang tackled after another first down pickup. Iron Johnson and company there to make the stop. But if Tornado was in position, he could have turned around and got an interception, but get the ball a little more air here. Brown getting air onto this one, but overthrows his intended receiver. That was White again. Yeah, but, you know, every now and then you got to spread it out downfield, but what time to get that ball back on the ground more or next time with the ball? Let's see if Kansas can do anything on their end with the ball. Kwame Lasseter with the fair catch. Kansas, to your point, will take over from their own 32. Then they'll start throwing down the field later in the game. 33. Stanley back to pass. Tries to go downfield and has a receiver open. He makes the catch inside Boston College territory. Stephon Robinson. Back at that last passing play deep down the field. Watch him right here in the pocket. Kind of steps up, plants his foot, and gets the ball out. It's not a perfect spiral, but it doesn't need to be. It's in the perfect location. Leads his receiver. Back in his quarterback's mind and arm. Stanley quickly again. Out here to Lassiter again. Close to another first down. They'll move the sticks after a gain of 12. This time Puka has a lot of room up the middle. 
Vinny De Palma makes the stop, but not after, until a nine-yard gain downfield. Stanley taking his time before snapping it. The pitch out to Williams, and he can get to the edge. He got the corner. He does. Inside the 20, another first down. 1982 in the Big 8. Taking the handoff to Herbert. Stanley's got a receiver wide open in the end zone for a score. Jack Luavasa with his first touchdown puts Kansas on the board. It really was a good play. Watch right here. Clears out the middle of the field. Just sneaks right in behind the linebacker. It's a perfectly thrown ball. The momentum now BC taking over, and they got a little away from what they did so well early in the game on that last possession. Now handing it right back to number two, but he's going to get dropped for a loss. Jay Deneen was there. You got the dangerous Zay Flowers at the top of your screen. Let's see if he get involved. Brown has time. It's Flowers. Good call on that one, Mark. First down for the Eagles. A little bit more this year. Third and one. Now David Bailey, another power back in, but Brown just opts to keep it himself and run behind that physical offensive line. First down for the Eagles. You only scoring range. Running back out wide, looking to get out. Brown gets to Bailey's hands. What can he do after the catch? Makes a few men miss. Inside the 30, still on his feet. Bounces his way to the 20-yard line. First down for BC. Back in the game, now flanking Brown in the gun. White again in motion. The fake to Dylan, the tight end wide open, he'll walk into the end zone. That's Cor Abadrizi, Boston College, another six on the board. Let me show you right here. He's right here in the slot, and this linebacker just stays put. Cor Abadrizi sneaks right in behind him, and it looks like the linebacker is just staring at the quarterback and has no concept that there's a tight end right in behind him in the passing window. and. Anthony Brown just, as well as their entire pass game package, and you see right there the soft hands of their tight ends allows them to do that. Jamal Horn back to receive this kick for Kansas, picks it up at his 15. He has some room outside to the 30, to the 40, near midfield, finally pushed out of bounds in BC territory by Danny Long. Ten point lead for BC heading to the second quarter. Carter Stanley fakes to his running back, has a receiver wide open downfield, 15, 10, 5, Inside the five, down to the one. Andrew Parchment was wide open across the middle. Watch Puka right in the backfield. He sprints out to his left, to his right, and deep opens up that lane for Parchment to get right back in there behind the linebackers. Carrying the ball to the goal line. Is he in? Hudson good? Hall was the ball carry. The officials now signal a score. Big boy for the score. And watch the offensive line by Kansas. This is something that they've really lacked is that ability to move a defensive front this season and they got movement on boston college on that one and got their big fullback in the end zone now going bounces it outside he'll pick up the first down and more 30 yard line puts his head down 37 yard line giving 24 yards on the carry bailey now spelling dylan for a moment Oh, Bailey, nice move in the backfield. And look at him move that pile into Kansas territory. That'll be a first down. Eagles five for seven on third down so far tonight. Brown, pump fakes. Now hits Bird as tight end. That's going to be a first down. Brown set it up perfectly to get those extra yards. And Brown's going to keep it on third and one, trying to utilize that surge. He's going to be right at the yard mark. It was right at the 25. If that's where they spot, that's going to be enough, I believe, for a first down, but they're going to measure here. Here comes Zay. Trying to get a block in the edge. Kansas did a good job of pursuit that time. Picked up maybe five yards. Running back. And we'll give it to Dillon. I mean, he's met in the backfield. Shakes the initial tackler, but he isn't able to get to the first down. Drew Prox is there and stops him for a game for no gain. And they do. Brown outside behind his receiver, Kobe White, and Kansas is going to take over defensively. That's what it's about. So the Pete Frady Center, baseball and softball, Margot Canal Recreation Center, Fishfield House, and uh, we're not stopping. So we're pushing a lot. 
All right, this team isn't stopping either, Martin. Thanks so much. Thank you, Kelsey. All right, thanks, Kels Martin. Kansas isn't stopping. Yeah. Big missed tackle by Nolan Borgerson on that play. Allowed a lot of yards after the catch. And wide open, Lassiter again down the middle. Inside the 35, down to the 34-yard line. Sure, play some zone behind him, but they got to get Carter Stanley off his spot. Fake to Williams, and he'll keep it. Leaps over the defender and picks up a first down. <laughs> Look at this. Uh, and this play right here, it's just perfect. Read option. Whoop! Went right, he went right over the defender. Nolan Morgerson had a tough series. Missed the tackle. Les absolutely loves it. Whoa, look at that. Puka reverses his field. Now tries to find room, can't find anything. Maybe loses a yard. Herbert the bigger back now in the backfield, flanking Stanley. He'll get the carry. Inside, still has room on his feet, powering close to that first down marker. Stanley back to pass. Looking at the corner of the end zone. Has a receiver that's caught for a touchdown. Andrew Parchment. Does so well on this play is he gets some loft under the ball. Gets it over top of both defenders and hits his wide receiver in the back of the end zone. And it looked like for a second it was going to be intercepted. And see if the coach's confidence in him comes back and they throw the ball a little bit more in this drive. Mike Lines in the backfield. He'll take the handoff. Trying to get to the outside, which he does. 35. Knocked out of bounds near the first down yard marker. He'll pick up right about nine yards. Penalties and Idrisi guilty of the false start. Moves him back five yards. Now Dylan out of the backfield. Lines. Makes one man miss. Has a big block in front of him. Flag down as he gets inside of Kansas territory. Dropped at the 41. We'll have to check the flag to see if it comes back. 15 yards. Clock winding down here in the first half. Getting to two minutes. Brown has all kinds of time. And the receiver over the middle. It's his tight end. Oh, Hunter Long made a man miss. He fumbled the football, but fell on it as well. Two tight ends split wide with Bailey in the backfield. Brown looking for one of those tight ends. Man, that was a tight window. And he was able to connect. First down for Boston College. White in motion. Double reverse. Oh, oh there he goes. Wide open, and he'll walk into the end zone. Field. And look at this. You got a double reverse. And right there, number 11's in the game. The defense needs to say, hmm, this doesn't seem right. We haven't seen this guy before. The reason why he's in is because he was a high school quarterback. Gets a nice little spiral on the ball. It really was a nice pass. How many times do you see a situation like that where the receiver has a wide open quarterback and he chucks it over his head? Came back to the Heights. First coaching career. Herbert. Trying to make something happen here, and does. A big run for the Kansas back. 50, 40. Stiff arm still on his feet. Has a blocker in front of him. 15, 10, 5. Dives to the pylon, and they're going to rule him out of bounds at the three-yard line. What a turn of events. Herbert goes 82 yards. That's close. It looks like his right pinky toe might have raise that line. Let's see from this angle right here. Previous play is under further review. And you'll see at the next step. Oh, right, right there. there yep. The Three-yard line. With the quickly throw to the end zone. Touchdown! It's Parchment again! You see 28 in the right side of your screen. Right there! Like the sea of hands. Just right there, and Boston College defense can't believe it. And tell you what, Carter Stanley loves it. Less. What does he think? Carter Stanley picks up the first down, holding that down on Kansas' first possession here in the second half. He gives to her wide open to midfield. Making another man miss, still on his feet at the 40-yard line, 30, 25, 20, knocked out of bounds inside the 15, another huge run by Khalil Herbert. 
You watch this right here. There's one linebacker off the ball, and he just can't find his way to the open gap, and, and this is exactly what Kansas wants to do. Unfortunately, it looks like it's coming back. Yeah, the, you, know, you see the end of this play, and BC is showing pressure. Are they going to drop back in zone, or are they going to come? They drop back. Stanley Parchman again to the 30. 20. Knocked out of bounds inside the 20. Now make it at the 21. These two are some kind of combination. Gildan Williams on the stretch. 20. Stays on his feet. Before stepping out inside the 10. Herbert flanking Stanley in the backfield. Stanley looking to throw. Now comes to the right side. Flushed out of the pocket. Nowhere to go, just throws it out of the back of the end zone. Trouble with the snap. Outstanding job by the holder, Donovan Gagan. Not so tonight. No, not so tonight at all. And he personally knew going into this, this prep week, he needed to be better. And, and he came out, and he is better. And he, it's, a, it's a refreshing take for this Kansas offense. And, Kansas fan base as well. Look at Levy carrying it over the 40-yard line, so a good start, a good opportunity for Boston College. It's only possible if we start to spread the defense out a little bit. Stays in the block this time. Brown under pressure, and he's going to get dropped. He got drilled. Azur Kamara. And he got absolutely drilled right here late in the play. Watch Anthony Brown. First, he avoids the sack. Blind side. That'll be in the back of his head. First sack allowed.